Okay, YouTube, welcome back to Fit Noobs Roll the Tanks with the Flying Fit. We're going to start this episode off with Tier 4 Battle. Let's go ahead and hop in with our Durchbuchsvagen 2. No one's told me I'm pronouncing that wrong. So I'm going to assume I'm pronouncing that right. However, it is possible that I just don't have any German viewership. That is that is possibly a thing. I'm not a fan of this map. Hmm. Yeah. Los Where's everybody else going? A bunch of people going this way. Fine. I'll go this way too. Isn't first class the highest class? Isn't first class the highest class? I.e. the best? Oh, I didn't know there was a whole other class of metal. Uh, I think that means we didn't penetrate. That time we did. It's KV-1 hiding around the corner here. Uh. What, uh, what hit you? I saw you get hit, but I don't know by what. I think there was a bullet that whizzed by my head. Hello, Martyr 38T that thinks it's sneaky. You are not as sneaky as you think. And here comes an M4 for support. Now you're going to be in trouble. Yeah, you better start running away. Only two tanks left of this KV-1 and this T-62. And I've done a grand total of six damage. That's what you call failing at heavy. Oh! Oh, I was just gonna say, there's a guy here, I'll be able to get some more kills, but no. Nope. I thought there's only two left, what happened there? I guess they had three left? Am I also failing at math? Holy crap, this M4 is deadly. I thought there was more guys behind him, but I think I'm it. I think that means I hit a friendly. You're kind of blocking the shot there, Panzer 4 eh? What happened there? Oh, we captured- I didn't realize we were capping their base. Uh, so there we go. 
bunch of experience there. Nowhere near enough. I need 13,000. But it was a win. Holy smokes. We're racking up the wins today. I'm sure that's about to change now. I just jinxed it. Dang it. All right, how about some artillery? Let's get a win on the artillery. I think it's been a while since I've won a Lorraine uh, artillery match. But this is a good good bat for it. Hopefully we got ourselves a good team. I know you can use KVM to show you the percentage chance to win, but honestly, I don't like that. I don't want to be discouraged or um, potentially over-encouraged and start being silly just because KVM says my team is really good or really bad. I'd prefer to not know. I really would. I think that's best for someone like me. I like how that thing just instantly flattens when I drive over it. And now we're blowing up all of our ammunition stores. Amazing. I don't know quite where you're going, but I'm going to head around the corner over here. There's a little bit of cover out this way that we can maybe grab uh, should we get to the point where we need it. I'll back up a little bit, I think. Swing everything around. All right. Too close. Danger close. In fact, I would even say closer than danger close. I have no desire engaging in closer than danger close artillery barrage. Ah, oh, fell short. Uh, heavy poses the bigger threat, though, I think. They just sit there. Oh, don't go that way. It's right at the edge. Oh, I'm going to have to reposition. Damn you, Excelsior. Damn you and your cunning ways. And now there's something blocking my shot. Oh, shot went long. Come on, artillery, you're killing me. Wow, this guy's quick. He's getting in uh, underneath my Mac, my um, closest range. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's shooting at me. Oh no, he might be shooting at that Panzer IV. Yeah, we uh, we are in trouble over here. Yeah, he was shooting at me. Holy smokes. I don't know why this artillery gives me so much more trouble than the other one. It's like the game's like, oh, Lorraine, let me put you on a team that's going to lose. <laughs> With the birch, it's like, oh, let me put you on a team that's going to win. Uh, Lorraine, let's do it again. Back on Ensk. I don't have good luck on Ensk as artillery. Most people, like I mentioned, they go through the buildings, so you can't really get shots out on them. I think if you're going to be on a side, though, this is the better side for artillery. I want to go, oof, most of the support's going to be on this side. But that side's more wide open. Oh, it's a tough one. I think I'm going to go this way. I'm going to start moving this way, and if support, if a lot of people come on this side, then I'll be able to stop, you know, in somewhere in this area. Maybe in that bush would be good to take out some of that fence so I can I still shoot. But I suspect most people are going to be moving through the buildings. I 
Oh man, am I gonna die already? Well, I bet that BT-7 didn't expect to see that have that happen. They do have enemy artillery though, and I don't want him counter artillerying me, so I'm gonna start moving. Oh, their artillery now has bigger problems. In the form of our M2 medium. Alright, so let's see... Can I shoot anybody? Not really. So I guess it, I'm going to focus more on kind of along this flank over here, where there's less support. Yeah, right is very weak. Right is just downright exposed. In fact, it's so exposed, I'm not staying here. I'm I'm leaving. I am running away at breakneck speeds. And I will turn here and try and support down in towards the cap circle. This makes me very ineffective as artillery because I've spent half the match friggin' running, except for the one guy that I killed. Completely inaccurate shot, but I figured I'd take it in case I got lucky and maybe help out that cruiser too. Okay, good, there's one down. There's more moving up through here. Of course, my current angle gives me no shot on them. Till they get up this far. I don't think anyone's really gonna move up this far. Only one guy left, I'm not gonna get a shot on him. Nope, game over. At least I killed one guy. Good job, everybody. Good job. Foreign experience, not uh, not a lot, but it's a little bit. Uh, I do have enough for the radio. It might have been this guy that I couldn't keep in radio coverage, so let's upgrade the radio on it. I know I was very close to unlocking that with the free experience, but I think the radio is really going to help. All right, AMX 38, let's do it. Ah, oh, good old Malinovka. <laughs> I love maps that I know. Curious. 278 ACR. No, ACR. No. Phone. Stop trying to correct it. Armored Cavalry Regiment. The 3rd Tennessee. Okay. Does he volunteer with that regiment, or is he part of that regiment and also volunteers? I don't know if that made sense. I'm curious if he volunteers with that regiment. I might have said that right, now that I'm thinking about it. I might have said exactly what I meant to say. I think I hit the T-18 with that shot. If he's still there, that one hit him, I'm pretty sure. That M2's dead. T-18, I believe, is still there, in that exact same location. There we go, that time I hit him. 
That time I definitely didn't. Uh, that time I think I went long. That time I hit him but couldn't penetrate. That time I went short, I think. There we go, he's dead. It's a little bit too close to my teammate for my taste. Now I'm way too exposed to artillery. It's not a great spot. We do have our Panzer 1C doing some good scouting for us there though, so... Ugh. Man. Untrained crews are so bad. There we go, killed him. Where, where was my gun? Why was my gun pointing like straight up? Heck was the point of that. That was obviously a miss. Ooh, that was close. Gotta lead this guy a fair bit because he is motoring. That fell short. That went way long. Alright, so he's moving around. Didn't penetrate. Didn't penetrate. I'll take one more. I'm gonna head this way. We've got uh, exposed artillery there. Oh, I was too late starting to move. There we go. I like to auto-aim when I'm running towards them, because this way, as soon as I can get a decent shot, I don't have to worry about it. I can just kind of start... There we go. You didn't need help. Look at that, you had it well under control. Uh, they're down to three. Two were spotted over here, and one is artillery, so I'm going to run up the side, I think. Uh, the side, not not the flank, but the side of this lake. AMX thirty eight has relocated a little bit. He's now dead. There's the other AMX 38 over there. I suspect their artillery is in this back corner. Yeah, this thing's not the slowest tank I've ever played, but it's certainly not the fastest either. Oh, come on, you guys seriously aren't going to cap. Don't be pussies. Go kill them. There's one artillery. Come on.
There we go. So there we go. We got a victory finally in our AMX 38. You keep telling me the Fury's here. I'm well aware that the Fury's here. I own a friggin' Fury. Uh, 4,600 XP needed. We're up to 2751. Uh, Panzer 1C. I'm going to do one more battle because things are going well. Got to capitalize when things are going well. Hmm. A message from work. That can't be good. Oh, yeah, that's whatever. And this is what? Oh, that's fine too. Just information stuff from work that I already knew about, so irrelevant. I very rarely get uh, communiques from work. It's never like... I'm very lucky that my job has no take-home work. I never get a message that's like, hey, could you do X? It just doesn't happen. There's something on... Did my screen cracked? How the heck could it have cracked? But I have to clean my screen after this. There's like a big line on it now. I don't know if it's a crack or just a line or how long it's been there or what the heck it is. I don't really want to go up there, I'll be honest. It's a bit of a killing tunnel. Doesn't sound like a wise move to me. I'm gonna come around this way to scout. Can I? Uh, no, I can't. How do you get over on that side? Or is there not, no way over on that side? I don't think there's a way over on that side. No, there must be. There's a road up there. Alright, I'm gonna go up that road. Should have been reloading all this time. Luckily, it's only a 10 second reload. Whoop. Oh. Whoop. Yeah, sure. You want to go first? You can go first. There's a lot coming up that road. Ah! Oh, M37. You are blocking. You're just going to die, you know that, right? Well, that's kind of nonsense. He stood there a lot longer than I did and didn't die. Uh, well, that's going to do it for this episode. I don't I don't know which way that's going to go, and I'm not really going to worry about it. The Panzer 1C is pretty far down my list. Uh, in fact, I believe we're not... We still have a bunch of Russian tanks to do, don't we? Done, done. Yeah, we still got a T-70 and an SU-76 to work on. Um, is the T-70 fast? 45. It's not horrible. What, um... It's faster than the Martyr II, and the Martyr II is not bad. Yeah, 45 is okay. What about the SU-76? Oh, wow, look at that. Faster tank destroyer. That's amazing. I'm going to get the T-70, though. Um, do I have light tank crew? I might have light tank crew. I don't think I have light tank crew. I really don't. But let's find out. You know, if I was doing this smart, I would only do, like, one light tank per country or whatever. I want medium per country and so on and so forth. And that way I would have uh, good crews for them all. Although I guess it doesn't really matter because when you retrain them, they lose. They're never quite as good as they used to be. Oh, look at that. I did have crew. Retrain. A 
It's kind of a crazy looking tank. Look at the slope on that stuff. Wow. Hope the gun mantle stick. It looks like it is. All right, so we got a T-70. Oh, it's before the French. Oh, that's interesting. Russian before French. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I feel like fighting. I'm going to do a uh, T-82 battle. Or you know what? Let's do the T-70. Let's try this bad boy out. It's only been 25 minutes. I've been I've been aiming. I upped the length of my World of Tanks series, if you didn't notice. I've been aiming for between 25 minutes and half an hour. Uh, and a lot of battles finish in five minutes. So let's let's do one more. Oh, excuse me again. Two armed man. Okay. Is that a man with two arms? Or two men with weapons? Where's my screen cleaner? It's right here. Where's my microfiber cloth? I don't know. It's usually right beside it. I don't know where it is. I might have used it to clean my guitar, in which case it's over in the other room. Well, there's famous last words. Alright, we got a scout running up that flank, so I want to move to that side of the building. So I can shoot at whatever he sees. Uh, can't hit that guy. All right. Can't see that guy anymore. Can't see the one that was over there. Fine. T-46 is still alive. Hopefully he does some more scouting for us. Uh, Panzer 1C sure did some good scouting for us. Holy smokes. Look at everything that's out there. I don't know if we can see any of this stuff, though. No. No, we cannot. Alright, now the enemy's making a bit of a push over on this flank as well. I think I'm stuck on that building. Yeah, there we go. Either someone's shooting blind, or they think they can hit me from wherever it is they are. Uh, we lost our scout over on that flank, which is not ideal. You're in trouble, aren't you, SU-76? Oh, oh, there you go, you managed. Good job. Uh, miss. Hit didn't pen. Hit didn't pen. Hit and penned. Miss. Miss. Come on. Yes, 
I'm very exposed here. Yep. Yep. Knew that couldn't last. Woof. Well, there you go. Less. Well, I guess it was pretty much five minutes exactly. All right. So I'm gonna end that there. Uh, a Panzer one lost. Not a shocker. But look at look at all the wins we got. What a good day. What a fantastic day. Forty-five point seven three. I've I've done so many fights now that it kind of takes a while for it to change. 506. Oh, it's only been 500 battles. Oh, oh I'm, I definitely am still a noob then. There's people out there with like 4,000 battles. Um, yeah, I guess tomorrow we'll keep plugging away M3 Lee priority, Birch Gun priority. Um, what did I click on? Okay. Um, Lorraine 39 L priority, AMX 38 a priority. And then we can kind of do some T70, some Martyr 2, you know, what not to fill in the blanks. All right, so that's going to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, please uh, leave a like. It really does help my channel grow. And don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see more content from me. But for now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.